Hey everybody, it's Tyler aka 150T and I am an online reseller on Poshmark, eBay, Macari and I also make videos for you guys on YouTube and Instagram and my Instagram is also 150T. Um, today I'm going to do something a little bit different. Um, I actually have a subscription box that I've been getting. Actually this is the second one I got. I got one last month from a referral from my Instagram and Poshmark friend uh, Pop Coco. You can check her out on Instagram and Poshmark. But it is Universal Yums. It's a subscription box for different um, snacks from around the world. Every month they do a certain country. Um, last month, now I can't remember, I'm blanking. But anyways, this month is, uh, I think it's Poland, if I remember correctly from the clue. I think I figured out. And yeah, basically this is the middle size box. Uh, it's called the Yum Yum Box. They also have a super yum box and basically this is 25 bucks you get a bunch of different snacks from this one country and a bunch of information i'll show you what's actually all in the box here in just a minute i'm not going to try anything today because i am trying to lose some weight and i'm going to use these as snacks and little treats along my way for the next month so i don't want them to spoil before i can actually try them um but i will put a referral code if you want to give this a shot and down below and you can check it out for yourself but it's last month was pretty fun, so I'm expecting this month will be too. And I love trying new, crazy, different foods and things. So if you that sounds like something you like, I will uh, definitely put the referral code down below. But figured I'd try to change it up and do something a little different than reselling. If you're here for reselling, this isn't going to be a reselling video. But something fun I like to do is kind of a little kind of hobby, I should say, or side thing. But anyways, let's get into this box. I did cut the tape already, so but I haven't looked inside. So when you open it up, there's a little topper. Let me pull it out of here. Let me set this off to the side. And it is definitely, it's Poland. And it gives you a bunch of little interesting tidbits and facts about some of the things in the boxes and some of the things about the country. Um, and on the back side, there is a little puzzle and a little game you can play. And then there's also a little ballad up here of the snacks that are in your box and things they want you to basically rank them. Share them on social media, and then you might be able to win some additional snacks and free stuff. So that's pretty cool. Every box then also comes with a little booklet. This one is obviously Poland, like I said. Um, inside, there is things about the country, which is informative and learning. It's kind of a fun thing, especially if you have a kid who's in school and learning geography and things like that. It can be a fun way to... Uh, incorporate them into this it also has trivia about the country little games and stuff like i said in the book and then there's informative pages about each of the snacks which when i pull these out of here i'll probably refer on this book because some of these i'm sure have weird names that i'm not going to pronounce right and you guys are probably going to hate but i figure what the heck but yeah they give you a bunch of different snacks um they also give you a yum bag which is full of candies which is another little section in the book. And after that, they have some more interesting tidbits and facts about the country. And also a local recipe, which this one is pierogi ruski. And then here's the answers to the trivia that they had previously. And these are a few of the snacks that you can go on online and buy if you find something you like in the box. They also sell them individually. And finally, then they have a clue for next month's box. And I'll read it to you guys, but the first word I am not going to be able to pronounce very well. So it says, Jedemy, the man said, and the woman looked up. But what she saw was his, him gazing at his empty cup of soup. Where we're headed next, the yum steal hearts away. Salty caramels, rich troubles, and cheesy souffle. So if you got an idea where that might be, plus these pictures kind of are little clues. Um, I kind of have a, a thought, but why don't you guys leave me a comment below? And also comment on if there's anything in this box that you like. Um, let me know. And I guess one other thing, since I'm not going to be eating anything today, I plan on making some maybe little things in my Instagram story every so often when I try something. And you guys can check that out at 130T on Instagram. But let's get started. Um, I should probably get the book here ready. These are some Monster Munch. 
They are little ghost looking. Looks like potato snacks. Um, just salted potato snacks. So they're basically a potato chip made into a little ghost form. So that's kind of cute and interesting. Next, we have crunchy sticks, paprika flavor. Um, so these are basically little, also little like potato-y sticks. Kind of like, I guess they have potato sticks here in the U.S. Um, let me see if I can actually get a little bit better description in the book here. Sorry, guys. Crunchy sticks. Yep, they're basically a paprika, paprika flavored potato stick. Next, let me see. I'll try to get ahead in the book and then we'll go back. These are I can't even gather Pyrnitsky Fasanui. I don't know, something like that. Chocolate covered gingerbread with an apple filling. These look kind of good. I think I've seen something like that at Aldi's before or Trader Joe's. Then we have here are some Riotas crackers with black cumin and onion. Hmm, that will be an interesting combination. Never had, had onion before, but nothing quite like that. Um, let's see, what else we got? Here is Dr. Gerald apricot mini cakes. So it's a nice little apricot cake. Sorry, my hand is over the picture of the food. That looks actually pretty dang good. So I'll be really interested to try that. Let me set that up there. Then let me get my next one pulled up here. These are some. Oh, my light's gonna glare off this package. There they go. Uh, these are some basically they're pretzel sticks with poppy seeds. So they're pretzel sticks instead of like salts. They're covered in poppy seeds. So that should be an interesting thing to try. Let's save that. Let's here we go. Next, this is Wale Milkes, which is a little chocolate bar with a sweetened condensed milk filling. Sorry, my hand is shaking. Holy cow. Let's see if I can steady it so it'll focus. There we go. I'm shaking. I don't know why. And let's see. Then we got same company. Wobble. This is called a Nut Break, which is a milk chocolate bar with salted peanut filling. Let me see if I can set this down. Give you guys a little bit better. Hopefully it'll focus. Not real great. There, it kind of did. Yeah, salted peanut filling, chocolate milk bar. And let's see what else we got. Okay, here's this thing. These are E. Weddle Pasty Meletsko. They're dark, dark chocolate covered vanilla marshmallows. Wow, I'm shaky. <laughs> There's five of them in there, it says. This sounds kind of good. And the last thing, or not the last thing, the last thing before the little candy bag is Tago Delis Maragus. Wow, I am not good at people's at reading languages. They're cookies with creamy nut filling and a dark chocolate drizzle. These actually look pretty dang good, and they're in a pretty big box. But that's what they look like. They look pretty damn good. There's five cookies in this package, so that'll probably be one of my favorite things, I would guess. Okay, so then let me get to the Yum Bag, which has the little candy chews and stuff in it. Normally are hard candies, depending on what they are. This is what it comes in normally, a little Yum Bag. Uh, it's got a bunch of different things, and it just kind of lets you know what's in there. So if we open it up here, there are a bunch of different things. Let's see the first thing. These are 
Kroka Melinska. These are like a chocolate fudge. I got a little cow and stuff on the wrapper. Let me see if I can turn it. Sorry. It's hard to see, but I don't know if it'll focus because my hand is shaking. There we go. And then there are a couple different flavors of these, which these are chocolate candies with strawberry and black currant fillings. They are Czech Slow Dawa Mislakana in Woe. Yeah, I'm going to butcher that. So anyways, yeah, dark chocolate candies or chocolate candies with strawberry and black currant filling. There's about, oh, six of those and four of the other ones. So yeah, anyways, that is all I got in this one. If you get the bigger box, you get a couple more things and you get a lot, a lot more of the little candies. Um, I haven't got one of those yet, but I have seen people unboxing them online. Um, but anyways, yeah, I'm not going to, like I said, not going to try anything today, but there are a lot of people that do. So if you want to go check out their videos, you can, um, maybe in the future I will, but at this point, yeah, I'm going to try to save some of the stuff and not eat it all at once because I'd like to do that. Uh, <laughs> anyways, um, so if you want to try it, remember, I'm going to put a referral link down below, leave some comments on things you'd like to try. Um, or anything you might know about because some people have tried some of this stuff before. I mean, it's available in the U.S. My hair's kind of nuts. Um, and I just, I don't know, something fun I'm going to start doing. If you like this, let me know, um, and I'll start making some more um, unboxing-type videos for non-reseller things. But otherwise, subscribe to this channel if you want to see reseller stuff. Hopefully some more subscription boxes. Um, and then like this video, subscribe. Check me out on Instagram, 150T. Like I said, I'm planning on sharing some of these things I try in my IG stories as the time goes on. And anyways, thanks for watching. Um, back to reseller content in the next video, but hope you guys enjoyed this. Please let me know again. And everybody, stay thrifty, my friends.